fans think Piper Raquel is a toxic friend. Because it seems like history is repeating itself and she's about to exploit her current best friend, Anna Kate, too. Today, I'm going to be replacing my best friend. Many people are actually concerned that the two friends have been so close lately, since we all know how most of Piper's friendships ended. I'm not joking, Emily. Like, you're being kicked out of the squad. And everything always looks so perfect that no one could have ever seen such seemingly strong bonds just to fall apart overnight. That's also why people were so shocked when they found out that the whole squad left Piper. Feels like I have no friends. But now that she has a new squad and a new bestie, their whole friendship seems oddly familiar. They film together, have sleepovers, and even travel together. However, if things really are that similar with her old friend group, Piper's current bestie, Anna Kate, might not stick around for much longer. Just remember how easily Piper cut off her years-long bestie, Emily Dobson. I just talked to my mom and you're not coming to Maui anymore. Are you serious? Emily also admitted that filming with Piper was taking a toll on her mental health and she just couldn't take it anymore. So she had no other choice but to leave the squad since her BFF Piper clearly didn't care enough to stand up for her or even talk her out of leaving for good. So much for friends forever stuff, right? But things only started going downhill for Piper from then on because Alania also left the squad and even sued Piper and her mom Tiffany for allegedly stealing her dog Lola. Number one, I never abandoned my dog. Number two, I can't just go onto someone's property and take something out of their house. That is trespassing. I cannot do that. She also said that Piper and Tiffany were insanely toxic towards her and other squad members, that they made them work seven days a week, even though they were just little kids. In the beginning, when there were a ton People. We were filming four videos a day, seven days a week. However, the Raquel family never addressed the drama. They simply denied everything and basically called Alania a liar. It's Eliana, yeah. Like, we like, like to leave her out because she's just like annoying. What made people believe Alania even more was the fact that Piper and Tiffany also got accused of child exploitation. In fact, Piper's whole ex-squad sued Tiffany and publicly exposed her for being overly toxic. She allegedly didn't pay them for the work they did, and she even made these kids dress and act provocatively. Tiffany would always tell me to go up into Piper's closet and get something that's more tight and revealing. And now fans are worried that she's doing the same with Anna Kate too, because she and Piper often pose and dance in inappropriate clothes. Most people think Tiffany's forcing them to do so because she knows that would bring them more views and likes. Others, though, are fed up with this too sexualized content, which is clearly not kid-friendly. They even started bashing this duo and leaving comments like, bro, whenever she replaces anyone, she's instantly her bestie. Not even a good duo. Emily and Piper is better in my opinion. Some even say that it's only a matter of time when Piper finally snaps and cuts her off like she did with her ex-friend. But what do you guys think? Is Piper and Anna Kate's friendship genuine, or is it doomed?